Boys and girls, we are back with another update to the Andrew Tate saga. Last time we left off, he had just been arrested. He, his house got raided by the Romanian police. He was taken into custody. Uh, at the time, it was only a couple days just to see where he was at. Um, it, since then, he has been back. In, he's back in jail for 30 days this time uh, while they do their investigations. He was set to uh, have a court hearing in two days. As of the recording of today, January 8th, uh, he was said to be in court, but he since has been hospitalized. He was into the hospital. Uh, he had a pre-existing health condition about something to do with his lungs. He had nodules in his lungs. If you don't know what that is, basically like little growths in his lungs. Um, so uh, they advised to take him to the hospital to just to make sure to do some scans and make sure it wasn't a cancerous nodule. So he was sentenced, or sentenced, he was sent to the hospital. Uh, but who knows? I mean, he could just be trying to buy some time. Um, it's kind of weird that he did it now out of, you know, he's had this condition for a while. It's kind of odd to have it done now. Again, I think he might just be wanting to buy some time. Maybe they'll push back the date even further, giving him some more time to, you know, get out of this situation or get his lawyers, you know, some more time to find a good excuse and why he's not a human trafficker. He did tweet. Uh, he tweeted, the Matrix has attacked me, but they misunderstand. You cannot kill an idea. Hard to kill. I don't know why I made that voice, but something tells me that's how he reads <laughs> so andrew tate was hospitalized um it says right here on this article that uh lung yeah lung yeah lung nodules is growth lung dead was well, being benign generally harmless you can it can be cancerous Tay asked to see a doctor in order to investigate this module nodule and request biopsy to ensure it wasn't a cancerous growth okay it says landing him in the hospital to have this issue properly investigated by medical professionals however He's made a tweet regarding related to this issues that's a bit vague on what the issue actually is, along with the reports that only reveals he's in the hospital. Um, I mean, if he's being attacked by the Matrix and he's only going for a checkup on a nodule on his lung, it's kind of weird that he's blaming the Matrix, but that's actually his scapegoat. Anytime anything happens to him, it's the Matrix. It's not him. It's not him. He can human traffic as many people as he wants. But once they talk about him, it's the Matrix going after him. You cannot criticize him because you're part of the Matrix, according to him. There was another report that said that he was attacked while in custody. Really hard to believe. I'm sure he isn't with the public. I'm sure he's in his private cell with Wi-Fi and a bed and meals and a massage, a masseuse and all that good stuff. So I kind of hard to believe that he was attacked. I think the... The checkup is probably the only and logical theory in this case. Not sure. Maybe he gets Jeffrey Epstein. Well, maybe if he does get sentenced to 15 years, I think that's what he's looking at, 15 years, maybe more. I'm not sure, depending on what they charge him with. I mean, it, there is a possibility that he could get Jeffrey Epstein, um, but who knows? We just got to wait and see. Um, we'll see him in court in a couple days, and we'll have another update from that anyways let me know what you guys think down below also leave me some good theories on why you think he's in the hospital um just because i love a good theory the pizza box theory was my favorite i still will stick to that <laughs> anyways i'll see you guys again in the next video peace out my beautiful people Mwah.